Hey brothers and sisters, God bless each and every single one of you. It's Hunter's Point here again. Uh, I was not, and I repeat, I was not planning on making a video today. Uh, I was planning on taking a couple days off from doing videos. I never wanted to get into you know, a routine where I was uploading videos every day because I don't want it to seem like you know I'm just out to make videos all the time. I make videos when I need to, when there's something that warrants a video. And the situation is no different today. Um, this is huge, by the way. Uh, this is from NBC, NBC News. They had a uh, immediate release of a letter. This is a statement from the press secretary for immediate release on October 6th, 2019. And I'm going to read it, and it reads as followed. Today, President Donald J. Trump spoke with President Recep Tayyip Erdogan of Turkey by telephone. Turkey will soon be moving forward with its long-planned operation into northern Syria. The United States Armed Forces will not support or be involved in the operation, and United States forces, having defeated the ISIS territorial caliphate, will no longer be in the immediate area. The United States government has pressed France, Germany, and other European nations, from which many captured ISIS fighters came, to take them back, but they did not want them and refused. The United States will not hold them for what could be many years in great cost to the United States taxpayer. Turkey will now be responsible for all ISIS fighters in the area captured over the past two years in the wake of the defeat of the territorial caliphate by the United States. And that's the end of the letter. That is huge prophetically. I believe that that is a partial, if not complete, fulfillment of Ezekiel 38 verse 13. We are seeing an alignment of nations at the ready to invade Israel through the north for a spoil. And, uh, you know, you'll have to go back to all of Ezekiel 38, which you all can read on your own time. It talks about the Gog and Magog War. It talks about Ethiopia, Libya, Persia. You know, and you notice Syria won't be directly involved, but now Turkey, which I believe are one of those nations that are going to come against Israel, they're now going to be seizing complete control of Syria. Syria will now belong to Turkey because the United States are completely withdrawing all of their troops. So, and I know Brother Barry Scarborough reported on a Turkey Syrian invasion a couple days ago or something. Well, he was. Man, he was right on. He, you know, nail on the, right on the head, uh, because it's happening actively right now. All of this information came out last night. So yeah, this is huge prophetically for the Ezekiel 38 and 39 war. And again, more precursors of the Great Tribulation period. So I hope that this was a blessing to you. I know this was a blessing for me to give this message. Again, I had no plans of making a video today. But, you know, news is news. Uh, when this broke, I was asleep. So, <laughs> you know, here we are now. Uh, if you have not been saved, if you have not accepted Christ into your heart, I suggest you do so immediately. Right? The Gospels, 1 Corinthians chapter 15, verses 1 through 4, which states that Jesus Christ died on the cross for your sins, was buried, and on the third day he rose from the dead according to the scriptures. Right? Romans 10, 9, and 10. For if you believe in your heart that God raised Jesus from the dead and confess with your mouth that Jesus is Lord, you will be saved, right? For with the heart man believeth unto righteousness, and with the mouth confession is made unto salvation. Uh, call upon the name of the Lord, right? Romans 10, 13, all who call upon the name of the Lord will be saved, right? The ABCs of salvation are in the description box below as always. Um, man, what a time we're living in, honestly. Well, I did not expect this this soon, but it just shows that we're living in the last days. These things are happening at a more rapid pace every day. It's like every day something's happening, and it's getting harder and harder to keep up with it. So, anyways, uh, should the Lord tarry, I will see you all in the next video. So, God bless all of you.